Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com with our college basketball free pick for Saturday, January 25th, 2020. We'll get to it in a moment. First quick note, if you're not yet a member over at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on the link below the video, get yourself set up for a free $60 account. Use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages or anybody else over at DocSports.com. It's as simple as that. Free $60 account. Give DocSports a trial run. Click on the link in the description box to get started. All right, here's what's going on for us. We are cutting this video before our Friday night games are final, so we'll update the records uh, later on this week and probably with uh, the Monday morning video. Uh, but as far as what's going on for us, we've got a big day mapped out for Saturday. Ton of games, obviously, in college basketball. We've got a multi-game card, and uh, we've got a big play as part of the multi-game card, an elite level play over at DocSports.com. So don't miss out on that. It'll be available Saturday, 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific and NBA at 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific on Saturday. You know how well we've done college basketball going back to mid-December, about the third week of December, over 60% winners against the spread. Let's continue and keep that going on Saturday, and I do appreciate those who have jumped on and been with us thus far. All right, let's get to our free pick in Saturday's college basketball. It's uh, Kentucky at Texas Tech. Tech will be a short favorite here. We don't like them to get the cover, though, in this home game. And I know you got Kentucky stepping out of the conference and going on the road. They started slowly. They had lost four of their first 16 games, which is you know, a shaky start for these elite programs. However, we know what Calipari does. He gets his teams ready as the season progresses, takes young blue chip players, and turns them into contenders by the time March rolls around. We think they're kind of already getting there. They've won a couple of games in a row. Now they go on the road to Lubbock where, listen, Proof of the pudding to me that Texas Tech is not yet ready to get to the you know, level that they want to be, and a lot of young players. And don't get me wrong, I completely respect Chris Beard, one of the top coaches in college basketball, no doubt about it. However, having said that, when you watched a game against another elite team not too long ago when they hosted the Baylor Bears, they got beat 57-52, yet Baylor finished the game with only six assists and 18 turnovers, yet Tech couldn't find a way to win the game at home. I just think they're on the wrong, or I should say, I just think they're not on the wrong path, but they're on a slower path to where they want to be than are the Kentucky Wildcats right now with their young players. And by the way, Kentucky doesn't have this barn-burning shooter who can get you 30 points on any given night. What they do have are four players who are averaging about 13 points per game apiece. I think they're just a little bit too deep for Tech. We're going to recommend a play on Kentucky over Texas Tech in Saturday's college basketball. All right, don't forget about, again, our multi-game card in college baskets. Over 60% in college basketball going back uh, to the third week of December. We'll have that at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific on Saturday. NBA, 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific. Also, be sure to check out our NFL uh, bi-week video that's been up for a couple of days now. We'll have new NFL videos starting with Monday's card. It's going to do it for me again. Our opinion is the Kentucky Wildcats cats over Texas Tech. If you like the videos, click on the thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Sprites of DocSports.com. Let's put Saturday in the win column. We'll be right back here Sunday by 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific, if not a bit earlier.